Hello, my revivers. Today, I'm going to show you how I make an easy, quick lemon glaze for the sour cream pound cake. Let's get started. So all you're going to need is three ingredients, confectionery sugar, lemon juice, and vanilla. You are going to start off by putting one and a half cup of confectionery sugar inside of your bowl. Then the next step is going to be to put a half a teaspoon of vanilla flavoring inside of your bowl. Now it's time to add the final ingredient, which is our lemon for the flavor, okay? So I'm gonna be using about, I wanna say about four teaspoons of lemon juice, but guys, I'm not adding it at one time. Why? Because according to the consistency of your powdered sugar, confectionery sugar, it can get watered down really fast. So you wanna add it slowly but surely, but the key is to look for a syrup-like consistency in the mixture. So that's why you don't see me put it all in at one time, but you will see me add more a little bit at a time. Oh, so if you wanted to know, the reason I'm using the sifter is because my lemon juice was frozen. So I didn't want the ice chunks to get inside of my mixture. But this is how simple and easy it is. There's so many ways to make glaze. There's different juices like orange juice, cranberry juice, different juices you can create this glaze with. And you also can make a glaze icing as I probably stated earlier in this video, which is a little bit thicker if you want to see it like sit on top. But I usually add like a butter or a cream cheese when I do those, but this is just a basic, quick and easy glaze. All right guys, so we have gotten the consistency that we need and it is time to ice this bad boy. So basically what you wanna do is slowly pour it around the cake and if you have a bunt cake like this, it'll automatically fall in certain areas of the cake on its own. And I'm not a wasteful person. So when it drips, I literally move the cake and I pick it up, the pan up, and I scrape it back into the bowl. And I do this several times until I get like most of the glaze on it because this cake will soak in all of the glaze. So this is the best way to do it and not be wasteful. So yeah, that's what I do. As you can see, the cake is soaking in all that goodness and I did it three times. I've did this three times just to get it all inside of that cake. As you can see, look at the pan below, it has been scraped. <laughs> so yeah, it doesn't matter. Let it just strip and fall whatever. And that is it guys. That is how you make a quick, easy, tasty glaze for your desserts and do you see how shiny it looks like a glazed donut that's glaze right there guys i hope you guys enjoyed this if you did thumbs up make sure you share it if you're new to the channel hit the notifications and join my reviver family and i will see you guys later gators